Hi, this is Michelle Rumshock, naturalist, and thanks for joining us with Virtual Experiences with the Hancock Park District. Today I'm out at Riverbend Recreation Area, and I wanted to talk about uh, trees and some of the leaves that we're starting to see. So last week um, we were out at Litzenberg looking at the spring wildflowers. So spring is definitely upon us, warmer weather, except for today, it's a little chilly out today. But things are definitely starting to green up. So you might be noticing some of the flowers you planted, daffodils and things have already popped up. Um, and nature's kind of slowly getting there. And there's a few trees that are starting to show their leaves. And I wanted to highlight a couple of those. So if you're out in the parks, um, oak woods definitely in here at Riverbend, you might notice these. Um, and these are Ohio Buckeyes. So of course you might recognize that for sure that it's Ohio State tree. Um, and you can see there's some small ones here and they've already had their leaves out. They're starting to unroll. Um, how you know you're looking at one, um, first you look at, look at the branches and see that they're opposite. So they have one branch or leaf across from each other. There's only a couple of tree groups that do this. Maples, ashes, dogwoods, and then members of the horse chestnut, chestnut family that includes the horse chestnut and then your buckeyes will have that. Um, everything else is alternate so if you've got an opposite arrangement you know you're looking at um, hopefully a, a buckeye. And the leaves if you see here um, there's many leaflets that make up that leaf and we call that palmate leaf compound. Compound because it has many leaves and palmate because look at your hand it's like the fingers come from the palm of your hand and that's what's happening with growth 